Right, Thursday morning, back at Western Park Hospital, and we're going in to see if my bloods are all right. Make sure I'm on a low dose now, steroids, so come Monday I'll be on one. So he says that's a safe, safe bet to safe bet to uh, get back on uh, get back on uh, the dual immunotherapy. So we'll uh, we'll see how we get on. So uh, right, let's go. Get checked in a bit early, but I'll have to get here early and uh, be late. So this is where we are. and uh, get checked in, nice and quiet, so we'll see where we are. So, in the chair, waiting for the bloods to be done. Hello ladies, you're right. See what happens. So, every Thursday, this happens. So hopefully everything's all right, I feel all right. So. That's all. What is this? Pints of claret today. <laughs> so they always say a little scratch, but it's like a little Ah, uh, don't say that long. Oh, then, perfect. Um, there we go. And then we'll your journey, that's what I'm saying. Journey. That's what I wanted to say. Yeah, I wish I wouldn't go in on it though. I know. So, a couple of these bloods now, and these go down to the Hallamshire, don't they? They do love the tested. Yeah, they go over to Hallamshire, to the labs. And we'll see if we're alright to kick start again on Monday. Right, so we're in here now. Dr. Lasser's room, well, one of many of Dr. Lasser's room. Five past, five past ten. It's not too bad. We'll see if the blood tests have come through and then we'll, uh, we'll take it from there. So, uh, just wait for Dr. Lasser now and then we'll, uh, hopefully it's all systems go, which could be quite, well, one or two things really. I suppose it'll be it'll be good because I'll be back on my treatment. But uh, I think I've had about it's seven weeks, eight weeks off treatment. I've only had two two doses of dual immunotherapy, or another two another two to get. But when it's when it first started, it, well, it hospitalised me for one, and then and then two. I felt like absolute. Crap! It's like a car crash, and then obviously coming off because my liver was inflamed, which in fact could uh, could kill you. So yeah, probably mixed emotions if I'm uh, if I'm back on it. So we'll uh, wait while he arrives and we'll uh, we'll see what he has to say. So, just back from Western Park uh, Hospital, and uh, Dr. Lester's going to keep me on one drug, which is the Nivolia Lab. I think I pronounced that right, that, that I'm very not done. And not put me on the other one, because it's the other one that was making me, making me quite ill. So that's going to last, that's going to start on Monday, quarter past 12. So, uh, and then that's going to be four weeks, every four weeks now, not three, every four weeks. Till, uh, till, fur till further notice, and there'll be a PET, PET scan, four to six weeks, and we'll see if we've shrunk, or at least captured, the tumour in my leg, and the tumour in my kidney. But watch the post next week, so I'm gonna show you exactly where this cancer is. So I'll, I'll show you everywhere where that is. So Dr. Les explained the, the trials that, um, Trials that go on, uh, and he says there's no evidence of having 
the, the other drug that I was that I was taking after two weeks or after four weeks. So there's no such explanation why it works in some people and why it doesn't work in others. I just hope this drug takes on Monday and we can uh, we can crack on. So I'm a little bit a little bit apprehensive because I know how I know how poorly I was last time. Obviously, really hospitalised and. And just and just feeling horrendously horrendously bad. So with just taking the one drug, I'm, I'm, my body might react a little bit bad. But uh, keep watching the posts, and I'll uh, I'll keep you updated. Have a good weekend. Bring it on. Tim's three-way venison dish includes pan-fried liver, which seems to be a controversial choice. So Tim, do you think liver is a bit risky to be cooking for 100 people? I don't think so. It is going to quickly be pan-seared, and that's all it's going to be. Yeah, but I said that. Fat TV. <laughs>